Hey Harvest Lands Church, Jordan and I miss you guys very much and we're really looking forward to the time where we can all be together and have some hugs and loves. Um, so before I kind of get started with what I hope to share with you, um, I just want to share a quote from one of my favorite authors, Brene Brown, that she posted on her Instagram the other week and I think it's just a good thing to get started with, a good reminder for us. So she says four things on a little post-it note. And the first thing is hitting the wall is real. The second is hard days suck. The third, let me look at my notes, there is nothing wrong with us. <laughs> and lastly, fourth, we're gonna be okay. So I actually, I have some notes here, so if I look down, I'm totally looking at you in my heart. Um, but I wanted to read a quote um, for you from this book, Reaching Out by Henry Nowen. And he says, in the midst of a turbulent, often chaotic life, we are called to reach out with courageous honesty to our innermost self, with relentless care to our fellow human beings, and with increasing prayer to our God. To do that, however, we have to face and explore directly our inner restlessness, our mixed feelings toward others, and our deep-seated suspicions about the absence of God. So this really speaks to me during this really weird, strange time. And I think the, the polite term that probably a lot of us have been hearing is challenging time. But I think turbulent, chaotic, and my personal favorites, weird and sucky, um, kind of describe things a little bit more poignantly for me. So taking from this quote, here's what I hope for all of us. I hope that we can take reaching out to the next level. I hope we can reach inward with God sitting next to us and show him the icky restlessness in our hearts and say, help me, take this on with me. I hope we can reach out to our neighbors, those in need and those we would rather not deal with and find ways to love them. I hope that we can keep asking God tough questions and be honest with him and know that he is closer than our breath. And lastly, I think the thing that's going to help us do all of these things to reach inward, to reach outward, and to reach upward is to seek first the kingdom of God and his righteousness, because that's when we'll get all we need. That's when we'll find comfort and strength to reach out, to love deeply, and to deal with our junk and rest in Jesus. So I know that this is probably a, a time of a lot of us dealing with our junk, but God is sitting with us. God is close to us and uh, he can handle whatever big feelings we have. And so just wanna encourage you with that message today and let you guys know that I love you very much and hope to see you soon. Bye.